Hello there, Internet. I am your, your host, J Man. Welcome back to Let's Play Sailor Moon. Another story we left off. We basically um traveled to the Silver Millennium, and then at some point uh, something happened, and Usagi got kidnapped by Ramses from Xenogears. I'm guessing he was sick of being like I was. Box door, Vega. Hmm. Where exactly are they? Silver Millennium. Oh yeah, the Silver Millennium. Because uh, something happened. All right. Oh, I thought it was gonna be another cutscene. It's me, you're not a wise man. This really is Zeno Gears! Zeno Gears came back to haunt me! You know what, man told me, Endo, that the egg is the only love inside me. But how? Should we use a setting right here? And yet, you're yeah. nothing out here. And you had nothing as a sign before you. Lady Apsu is not changing this period's destiny. It changes me how yet I don't really realize this, but soon it'll become reality. Soon Sin and her friends are as one of rainbow crystals. What? Pretty impossible! Here as I speak, the silver crystal's power grows weaker and weaker. And with its full strength fading, my former self will disappear. That's because Lady Apsu was in history. Alright, yo. <gasps> oh, and I also heard the new Marvel TV series, Echo. Uh, you know I don't have Disney Plus right now, right? Oh, yeah. Forgot about that. Um, oh. Uh... I heard about your, your brother's new dog. Yeah, was a we, yellow we got one. another hellhound. His name is Captain. Oh. Yes, you're a hellhound. Whoa! Okay, so, uh... I actually found... So, remember how I said that the... More, that the... Anime nowadays is, uh... Was dubbed by a company called, uh... Viz Media? Well... I found a clip... That's a little, uh, risque... From the, from the current dub. I like the share of you, but it might make you uh, a little weird. Basically, I know like one episode there, like there's like something about like a school play about Snow White. Oh, Snow White. Do y'all remember that one? Uh huh. Well, apparently in this, I'm 90% sure they didn't say this for the Deke dub. Basically, they also are arguing about who should have the the leading role. I'm guessing they really want some of that Mamoru. Uh. Mm -mm. uh but apparently, uh, Makoto starts arguing and saying that she should be the... She should have the leading role. Because, and I quote, she had the bigger boobs. I am not kidding. They actually said that. <sighs> Makoto even follows up by saying, Want to make measurements? 
I am 90% sure they did not say that in the Deke dub. If anyone knows what they actually said, let me know in the comment. What, what they actually did say in the Deke version, let me know in the comments. It's gonna be another long ass boss fight, I can tell you that. Uh. Huh, the Black Lady looks exactly like Sailor Moon. Well, I mean, it is, uh, literally, like, her, they said, did say it was, like, Usagi's, uh, Chibiusa, like, an older version of her from the future or something. Uh, oh, her from the Silver hair. Millennium. And, you know. Yeah, again, does anyone know what they actually said in... Oh my gosh, she had a 421. Funny weed number. Or closest thing to it anyway. Oh yeah, something else that happened recently. Uh, so I noticed uh, the first episode didn't really record properly. Like, it's just like a still image and just me, my dialogue. Me and Huega's dialogue. I'm probably gonna re I kind of agree we'll try and like re-record that beginning anyway did it start over no well, like I said it's only just gonna be like the for the first uh, chapter hmm. like the first half of the game like up until like they like when they're at that temple that uh, right works for. Also, does anyone, like, know if, like, what the original version was like, like, how they did that for the Deke version? Because Deke, like four kids, love to pretend that countries that aren't the United States existed. It was like their religion. But, uh, 
Obviously, with a character that has like a very Japanese eccentric job. That's kind of a hard thing to do. those rainbow crystals yeah it's similar to those colorful diamonds okay all kinds of gemstones maybe the crazy diamond oh yeah right like it doesn't know what Joseph's bizarre adventure is oh then again she bought me a t-shirt of Kurotiota! Yep. all right just like you like anything in anime, okay. all of your favorite kind of shows. So do you not know about the... Oh yeah, right. So, you don't know what Jojo's Bizarre Adventure is. It's an anime that basically just... It's a very hard and convoluted franchise to explain. Basically, there's a bunch of arcs, and one of the fourth arc is called Diamond is Unbreakable. Basically, it's it starts out like usually like a slice of life thing, but then it starts getting involved with like, like a murder mystery type thing. Basically, the main character's a. Uh, the franchise is known for these things called stand, which are manifestations of like a people. of like a fighting spirit of sorts. And at first, they were named after tarot cards and Egyptian gods. This was pre Yu Gi Oh, by the way. But then the creator decided, you know what? I'm gonna name this after all the ran a bunch of random Western music I, I listen to. Yeah, so he obviously started. So then he started naming all the making references to all these popular like Western singers and bands. Um, particularly, he's a big fan of of uh, who was a big fan of Prince. And so obviously, for legal reasons, they could not um, call them by their original names in the. In the English dub. So basically, the main character of part four, Yos Josuke Hikashita, has a stand called Sh Crazy Diamond, which of course is named after the Pink Floyd album. But in the dub, it's called Shining Diamond. Also, there's a Character like literally like a bunch of characters like the name of other Western music. Judge is a hard franchise to explain. Mostly. I guess 90% of JoJo is memes.
You don't have to apologize whenever I do memes. I have to... No, that's what my audience is for. That's what my parents are for. Like, 90% of my brain is memes. And... And Among Us. Yeah, so another story that happened. So, so basically my... Uh, I'm just gonna check and make sure I look. Okay, good. Yeah, well, I can't really think of anything else weird memes to talk about, but, uh... Huh, you brought all the cures. No, nah, I brought- I, I- This is what happens when you've play, been playing JRPGs for years, woman. Uh... Yeah. I've- I've spent way too much money on random- uh, Random equipment that I may or may not- That I probably should have spent on armor. She, she's been poisoned, but I... So far, the poison hasn't killed her yet. Although, I might use a heal on her later. Like, I never... She's, like, the one I know the least about, but, uh... I mean, I know she's definitely older than the main cast. I don't even know if, like, she has, like, a civilian identity or anything, like... I know that little about her. Mm. You know anything about her, Huega? No. About Sailor Pluto? Like, backstory-wise? Well, she might be a college student. Well, yeah, I think you told me that last time, about her being a college student. Well, Pluto was just the smallest planet of the solar system. And yes, before, again, reminder, before any of these science nerds are like, Eh, Pluto's not a planet! This came out in the 90s! Is that rainbow magic? No, that's a. Uh, she casted a uh, illusion, which uh. So you know confusion in the Pokemon franchise. Oh yeah. Confused when uh, Pokemon like gets confused, they start 
punching themselves like every five seconds. Yeah, they also use some sort of confuse ray. Well, they do that. All kinds of moves they did. Uh, you know, peek. I can't. Some sort of psychic abilities. I can't Pokemon. I, I haven't Pokemon in years. You know, I I probably should have done a Let's Play a Pokemon uh, Legends Arceus instead. Especially legendary Pokemon. Uh, uh, Arceus is literally God. Or Joshua. From the Worlds of You. Do you not remember that? No. The anime we watched like three years ago, The World Ends With You, it was like based on a game I was a big yeah, fan of. Yeah, I watched that. Do you not no, remember who uh, Joshua that. was? No. He was like the Neku second partner. Basically. But pretty much everyone in the fandom calls him Gay Jesus because, uh, well, for reasons. And because, well, he's act pretty much the equivalent to God. Because he was the composer of Shibuya. That was a nice Shibuya. distraction. Yeah, I had to my. Uh... Oh, poisoned. I know, but. Uh... Alright, I'll be right back. Okay. Just keep on fighting. I'll try. <laughs> Anyway, let no complete. Why well, I went to probably torture a guy. Maybe. I mean, wait, did I leave Kanata at her place? Yeah, I think I did. Rick and Morty comrade. Rick and Morty with peak comedy and communism comrade. I'm tr I'm really trying. God, this pal system is so slow.
story. Well. Well. Oh crap. Uh, what? Oh, sorry. Something happened. Boy, uh, probably got back from stabbing Kanade. Dog Ahsoka is crazy. Okay, never mind. Ahsoka, her dog bit uh, Kanade multiple times. Hmm. It was glorious. How many chapters of the story? Have I mean, you well, we're, I, we're probably near the end game. The end game. As oh, in, yeah. we're getting close to actually finishing the story, which is good because uh, I think doing this game was a mistake. Oh, and you hear about next month the uh, new live action Avatar The Last Airbender? Yeah, I heard of that, but. Uh... I'm I skeptical. Are... I mean, on one hand, Netflix finally learned how to make good, uh, because on one hand, Netflix finally learned how to make good live action anime. On the other hand, they recently messed up with Yu Yu Hakusho and. Oh, yeah, Yu Yu Hakusho. Yeah, they messed up with they yeah, messed up with the, with the live action Yu Hakusho series. Okay, Not to mention, I remember that. hearing that the writers were that the writers of the, action, the original show were end up like leaving production because uh, I guess some random bullshit Netflix was doing. Uh. By the way, M Night Shyamalan. Oh yeah, he's the director. M Night Shyamalan. How are you not? How are you not ang shouting random anger about how he ruined Avatar? Uh, Do you not remember? Okay. Oh, uh, that live-action movie, The Last that, Airbender. The one that no one likes to speak of. All I know is that movie was the uh, is. Probably a violation of Geneva Convention. Yeah. Hopefully, it's going to be dead soon. Oh yeah. Hey Kenji, can you bring uh Yes, J Bad, set top him. Bring me uh go by Huega's house and pick up uh 
Get out of his body. Don't worry, she respawns upon death. Huh? Oh, it. Lore time. Uh. I'm gonna pause the record. Don't worry, I'll get back to it. We're back! Uh. So as I said, I explained some things to Wega, mainly some stuff about uh, Kanade. And that Kenji's gone by her house. Uh, Kenji, I'm back from the I'm back from your girlfriend's from the mistress's house," said Topham. Because you guys gotta remember, he is a descendant of Albert Simon from Shadow Hearts. Don't bring my ancestor. Don't bring my ancestor into this. Said Topham. Yeah, I'm probably going like, to time the boss. So, basically, obviously the judges, who, if you don't remember Huega, are those that judge those upon death. The judges, obviously, for all the crimes she did, mostly the dog murder, which the judges don't take too kindly. Set it to hell, and upon my request, I asked them to make or my, my new practice dummy after Kenji did this. All of this because I... Because I... I had to kill to try and save some children. Said Topham. Children that you may or may not have done things to. You really do not like... You know I never actually did those things. Said Topham. Yeah, I'm playing it on a stopwatch because, uh... Remember I show you my new art project? My yes, another device? painting of another painter in hell. I did the Chinese dragon. Yes. That was for the Lunar New Year. It's the year of the dragon. Uh-huh. Very aware. Last year was the year of the rabbit, if I was correct. No, that's year of the tiger. 
Okay. You're the tiger! Oh, yay! Finally! Yeah! Born, you're the sheep. All right. Born, you're the sheep in 1991. All right, uh... You you're the fools. Tiger. You will regret opposing Lady Apsu. All right, well, I think we might go back just to get some items. Assuming if they can let us do that. Crystal. I know. All I know about Sailor Moon Crystal was that fans don't really like it as much. Damn it. I know how very similar this game is with Chrono Trigger and that there is an arc. Uh... It's more like Noah's arc from the Well, bottom. I know. The yes, I know. Almost any anybody from heaven and hell knows what Noah's Ark is. Um, oh, it's the biggest boat. Yeah, it's a yeah. giant boat. A then God got mad at humanity for being a bunch of assholes, so he's fled the earth. Some guy named Noah was spared. Uh. Right, yeah, we're very under leveled. Uh, hold on one sec. So I'm b we're back. So I was talking about how I got Kinji here in hell. So Kinji, come up here and tell him what you did. So Lord Jaden. Tell, forced me to tell you what I did. So, Monokuma, this cruel robotic teddy bear that supposedly they made a t-shirt out of. What? She probably didn't. What? Some remnant of the spare was probably needed the money, okay? <sighs> okay, fine. But still, Monokuma was, had a motive to try and... Um, what if that was way more cruel than his usual ones, but hit me personally. He locked us all in a room. We had to have each showed us a video of a special video, but we're not allowed to tell you oh, Hold that thought. Okay. My dad wants me to dish some ice cream. Can you pause it? I'll be right back. Well, like I said, you're not going to be missing on much. Sorry. Right, Kenji? Uh... Also, you really were kind of a an a, a jerk to your girlfriend. Here, have a knife and stab. Cannot aim multiple times in the face, will you? Uh, fine. Said Topham. She's back! Still buying the items. No, I bought the items, but I didn't have the oh. cash. It's called yen. So I know. Japanese money. Yeah, I, I'm very you know familiar with what yen is, woman. You but, still uh, live in Japan. So as I said about, like, about uh, Kinji, keep talking. Uh, basically, these children that... They were all great children that worked at the... Or that lived at the... Or, Orphanage that my cathedral ran. Oh, How you're back on Silver Millennium. Yes. Keep talking, Kenji. However, Monokuma told me that if I wanted to make sure these kids made it out alive, I had to kill. Something I didn't want to do, but had no choice. Unfortunately, Uh, huh, rainbow choker. And, uh, but Lord J-Man was not the kind of person that forgave me. 
basically, I had to kill two people. My, my initial target was Kanate. She was too weak and fragile for among everything. I didn't want to do it, but I had no choice. However, I was caught anyway. But however, I was my official attempt to kill Kanata. I was caught by 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 this really muscular lawyer, Kokero Yamaguchi. Oh, wait, Samurai Sail Scouts, I beg you, please stop my brother. I can't convince him on my own. That looks like Mamaru. Yeah. Yeah. Keep talking, Kenji. But anyway, as I said, I didn't want to do it, but. To avoid our witnesses, I had no choice but to kill Kakeru. In the end, I, ha I end up like using a cell phone. I'm not very good with modern technology, but I it was the only way I could to kill Kanade. I ended up using it, and for 10 minutes, Kanade was electrocuted. And shortly after, I was flown to space. Upon the trial, I was flown to space. Where I, where I, whereupon I was judged. Upon the other acts I had done, the judges were not too keen of me and sent me to hell. Where I was initially tortured by J Man Daily. As you were! And then. cannot I have? So, upon seeing this, even I thought that Kanade was a horrible person. So, upon this, Lord Jamin wanted to make sure that Kanade's sister Hibiki did not have to go to suffer from her. Thankfully, thankfully, Kanade was transported here to hell, where she has taken my role as the new practice dummy. As for me, well, I mean, I still I don't get paid here in hell, it's still part of my punishment, but I'm not the same as the but at least I don't torture the uh, any of my siblings," said Topham. Okay, more out of character stuff. So, uh, originally. It's basically a running joke I had about fire about uh I mean I already kinda knew that uh Kenji was gonna be a killer. I mean he was a priest and priest and not in Japanese and to extent Korean media. Not exactly treated the lightest. Hold on a sec. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, I'm gonna try and level grind a lot more because I'm severely underleveled. Hopefully, uh, level 40. Once, like, the airline that reaches, like, at least level 40.
Uh, or level 37 for everybody because, as I said. Yeah, get ready for more of this. Oh, wait. Oh, it's sick. No, that was a save point. to the Grim Reaper Junior. Grim Reaper drawing? No, Junior, because you gotta remember, I'm 90% sure that uh, Sailor Saturn is secretly death incarnate. Because of how overpowered she was earlier. Keyword was. Well, I got cash, but, uh... characters? No, I'm just trying like, to choose like a link set. Uh, like Link, because I know... Uh, Like 
happens and I want... Because I know link techs are a thing. I th th apparently there's... They lurk like somewhere like to... Doe or Trio attack, I think they're called, in Chrono Trigger. Even though mm. I haven't played much Chrono Trigger. No. Yeah, let's see if they can work. Oh, yeah. Whoa! Ah. Run away! And so the Sarah Scouts ran. They bravely ran away. All right, another safe state in case things go hay haywire again. Because yeah, I might just fight the boss anyway. Because they seemingly have less health, but more defense. So, that for the rose crystal, are you? That's what the Apacito girls said. I'm glad I stole it from them in that case. Though to tell the truth, I would have been content with you in this era. Leave you alone, Dem Ramses! Demande. I know. Remember, I, he looks like Ramses from Xenogears, and because of that, we're gonna pretend he's Ramses from Xenogears. How did you find this place? Was it Sapphire? <sighs> yeah, I was right. Demade, we'll ne never be saved. Even if we do go down the same path. I know like this, no, but I understand. However, I already do what reach my path. In that case, Demade, look out! Die, Sapphire. Demade. I just said I'm afraid. Hurry! You also. <laughs> Sapphire! My, my, what very low between rotten traitors. Sin! Oh, the sailor scouts will arrive at last. Our group has resurrected Demade. And then he ran off at the rose crystal. Now it's across paths. We... It's gonna happen, we're gonna send Demade no matter what. Oh, I'm looking some stuff up.
Hey, I'm going to the bathroom. Okay. Try, try, take it down. Where I'm trying you? to.
I'm back. I'm back. Okay. Hey, haven't you seen the What If season two? No. Uh. Like I said, I'm not that big of a fan of Marvel as I used to be. Well, we used to watch What If season one. Yeah. Nine. Well. Uh, first season was fine. Yeah. Not ever said sure about Marvel after. Uh, After Ant Man and Wasp. Quantum. Yeah, but I'll be honest, that movie was not very good. Like, er, I think that might have been like the first time I ever watched a movie where I didn't have like a favorite part. Aside from, I can't even remember any character's name, like, that were the main characters. And I only know Phil Murphy. Bill Murray was in it. It's like the only thing I've known that he's in for in years. We watched the third Ant Man movie. You I know. Uh, oh, what about Modok? Modok. Even then, Modok was like more of a just a uh, how terrible the CGI was. Although uh, loaded head. I know, but even then. Among Us. I swear, my sense of humor has been set back for years. I did not like that sound bit. Oh, just popping my knuckles. Uh... Okay, I got a calculator on my... Well, you've done things, science things. Well, like I said, I'm gonna try and... Hopefully speed up the fight a little bit by calculating when they point the die.
Yeah, I've been playing a bit of Radiant Dawn. Fire, that's one of the Fire Emblem games that, uh... I'm sure you know, yes, it's the same franchise where I, uh... Alright, so that's my health and, uh... But basically, do you remember the, the the greatest knight in Canada you ever you drew for me? Yeah, Oscar. Oscar. And a, well, and he... I've been playing the sequel to the game that I made the Canadian thing in. I remember when I shattered your ears when I saw Andrew Graham. Oh yeah, from Team Gundam. With the, Did you not remember when I shattered your ears? Oh yeah, you shouted Canada so loudly. Well, I did that again! And you also like celebrating Canadian holidays. I know. Well, especially like wearing Royal Canadian Mountie uniforms. Yes, Oscar was that. So, uh... And, of course, riding on a moose. So, yes. I'm sure you guys might not remember this by now, but when I, for my birth, for uh, Canada Day last year, I made a, I requested Huega Rock make a painting of Oscar from Viral Path of Radiance in his natural habitat in front of the Canadian flag, dressed as a Mountie, riding a moose. Only thing missing was milk in the bag and Tim Hortons. Did you not know that? No. Okay, so in Canada, they have milk. So, mainly East Canada. There's a... Some parts of East Canada have milk in a bag. Ugh. Uh, don't Everybody. worry, it's not, apparently it's not as bad as it sells, because it spoils less. And it's supposedly a lot better for the for the Canadian environment, eh? Well, apparently it was something I kind of like knew about, and... So, about like two years ago, my brother went to Canada for, like, vacation. Oh, he did? Uh, and Which was there, he actually went there for, he ran to a guy from Ottawa, which is the capital of the, of the Canadian motherland, eh? And Oscar, and there, they asked the guy, if he drank milk in the bag, he said, yes, I drank milk in the bag. And then... There's the ten horses. Tim Hortons? So, so, Tim Hortons is a, is a donut restaurant chain in Canada, founded by a former Canadian ho hockey player of the same name. You can't get more Canadian than a donut restaurant founded by a, Can by a former hockey player. Uh... So, of course, it became like a massive kid stereotype of Canadians about the about Tim Hortons, and, uh... I asked Mom... So... I went to Can Last time I was in Canada was in 2019, where I, uh... Sadly, I didn't drink milk in the bag, but I also sadly didn't eat a Tim Hortons. Basically... So, I... Seven thousand seven hundred seventy-six. I'm having Fire Emblem Vietnam flashbacks. I'm having Fire Emblem Vietnam flashbacks, buddy. 
Honey, I am having severe viral Vietnam flashbacks. Stab me out of it. I am I am going insane because I am reminded of the a fire emblem Theresia 666. Good. So as I said, so then, oh, so basically when they went to Canada, they brought me back something there. Uh, Tim Hortons and Thermos. However, when they brought it, when they came back, they forgot to pack it. So they actually left it in the hotel. Thankfully, they were able to get it in the mail. a quarter of the way there. Yeah, also yesterday my back was hurting really bad. What happened? Uh, I really don't know what happened. Like, it cause... maybe, I highly doubt it's cancer. Cancer? No, I don't think it's cancer. That was a joke.
made it! Good job! That... You defeated her! Yes. What was that? A choice then. Time to withdraw! After all, why stay in fight when you got in what it... We wanted out of this age. But first, I have to deal with the traitor! That was for my mom and dad, you bastard! <gasps> hmm. Are you alright? Oh, good to see the scouts. It was the destiny I wanted. If I die here, the destiny will change. I want to live free of strife. Sailor scouts, go to the future. And the future doesn't change the present. The rose crystal. We got the rose crystal. Sis mode, sit moon. Luna? Is Demande? Thanks to him, we have the rose crystal. For everyone now, we have to get back moon. We have to beat the head of destiny. Yes. Come on, let's go back to the present. This is the end of chapter four. Make a diary about this, okay? And well, with that, I... Th I think I should end the episode right here. Like, subscribe, all that sexy stuff. See ya.